بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم اینڈ السلام علیکم ویلکم بیک ٹو مائی چینل ان مائی ٹوڈیز ویڈیو آئی ول ٹیل یو دی ڈفرینس بٹوین ٹو ڈی اینڈ تھری ڈی شیپس اینڈ آئی ول آلسو ٹیل یو دی ڈفرینس بٹوین اے پریزم اینڈ پیرامڈ اینڈ یس وی ول آلسو بی ڈسکسنگ فیسز اینڈ ایجز آف ڈفرینٹ شیپس سو لیٹس جس اسٹارٹ اٹ اوکے Uh, first of all, I'll tell you the main difference between 2D and uh, 3D shapes. 2D shapes are just flat shapes. They cannot hold anything in it. They are just flat, just like a surface of a paper. And 3D shapes are deep inside. You can put something in a 3D shape. They can hold something. They have a volume. It is not a 3D shape. Wait, this one is 3D shape. This one is 3D shape. You can put something in it. It is a 3D shape. And it is a 3D shape. This small circle on it is telling that it is a sphere. It is not a circle. This one is circle. Now we will cross out 2D shapes. It is 2D. It is just a flat shape. The star is just a flat shape. So it is 2D shape. The triangle is 2D shape and uh, this shape has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 edges. So it is a pentagon and it is a flat shape. And uh, this is rectangle. It is a flat shape. This has uh, 6 faces and 6 edges. So it is hexagon and it is a flat shape. Now... The difference I think is clear to you. 2D shapes are just the flat shapes. Whereas 3D shapes can hold something in it. They have depth. Like 2D shapes have only width and length. Okay, width and length. Uh, I put multiplication sign because uh, for finding area we put multiplication sign. We only can find its area. We cannot find volume of a 2D shape. But for 3D shape, we have three dimensions, width, length, and height. This is called height. Height. A 3D shape has height as well, width, length, height. And when we multiply these three dimensions, we can get the volume of any 3D shape. Not any 3D shape, uh, some shapes. All the 3D shapes have a uh, different formulas for finding volume okay now we will move to our next worksheet now i'll tell you uh, this this is a triangle it's a flat 2d shape and its 3d shape is a triangular prism it's a prism and it can be a triangular pyramid 3D shape of a triangle can be a triangular pyramid. How to draw a triangular pyramid? It's like that. It's a pyramid. Uh, the difference between pyramid and prism is pyramid always ends up meeting all the points on the top. And a prism uh, has a special quality that you can cut prism into equal pieces, into its equal slices. These are called uh, prism slices. Okay. Now, uh, let's join the shapes. It is, which shape is this? One, two, three, four, five. Five edges means it's a pentagon. And this one is pentagonal prism. Prism. Not pyramid because pyramid ends up with one single point on the top. Single point on the top is a pyramid. And this single point is called apex. Apex. Okay. Uh, it is a pentagonal prism. Now this shape will go with this one and this square will go with this cube. Mm, and this shape is called quadrilateral. And uh, this one is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Uh, 6 edges is hexagon and it is hexagonal prism. This circle will go into a cylinder. This circle's uh, 2D shape, circle is a 2D shape and its 3D shape is 
a cylinder and its 3D shape can be a sphere as well. A sphere, a ball. Now I'll tell you about these, these prisms and uh, pyramids. It is a prism. This one is pyramid ending up with one point. This is a prism because you can cut it into equal slices. This is a prism. We can, we can make slices of uh, this cuboid and it's also a prism and these are pyramids. Pyramids. Pyramids ending up with one single point and uh, on its each side you have a triangle here when the base is triangle. Base is, if, even if the base is not triangular base, base is a square base, even then you will have triangles on all sides. The reason is because they have to end up on one single point. Okay, and uh, no more worksheet here. Yes, let's do this one. Triangular prism. This one is triangular prism. The second one. The second one is square prism. This one is square prism. It is rectangular prism. Why is it called rectangular prism? Because its base is rectangle. Okay, it is pentagonal prism. This one is hexagonal prism and it's octagonal prism. This is a triangular pyramid. This is a square pyramid. See, its base is square. Its base is square. So that's why it is square pyramid. It is rectangular pyramid. This one is pentagonal pyramid, hexagonal pyramid, and octagonal pyramid. And uh, I hope you would have liked my video. And please subscribe to my channel. It will work like as a token of love from your side to me. And... Uh, as a, my appreciation i'll make more videos for you thanks for watching i love this